All right, so um, this is me in my unfinished um, Famous Stars and Straps shirt. This will be more tucked in. Um, this was actually a t-shirt that I commandeered. Um, it's unfinished, like I said, so that's why the thing's there, and it's, like, being weird right now, but, um, actually, take that out and fix it, because I can see myself now. Um, but I'm, like, obsessed with cutting up shirts now. I don't know what the deal is, but I really, like, <laughs> I just cut up, um, there we go. I just cut up my, it's always going to be there, um, Rolling Stone t-shirt. Um, this was a t-shirt, like I just said. Um, I poked some holes, made it a little bit more distressed, um, added some weird shit like the safety pin, um, added the red, and it was a really loose, loose shirt. So I made it a racing back and like knotted it and poked more holes and all sorts of stuff. This is destroyed now, but it looks really cool. Um, yeah, one t-shirt down. In the middle of this one, this is why there's, the sleeves were right here. I sewed this all by hand. It was a pain in the ass, and now it's gonna, like, it's gonna pucker. It's gonna stick out sometimes, but that's why it's so cool. Um, this one actually does a really good job of being straight. But this one, however, is being a bitch. Um... I still have yet to cut off the bottom seam, so it's like super duper long in my back, but um, yeah, if you guys would like tutorials on how to do this cool sort of stuff, let me know. Um, I'll fix this eventually, but yeah, I'll just do a quick little spinny spin. Um, yeah, so please let me know if you need, if you want tutorials on how to make um, shirts into cool dresses. Um, I'm probably going to experiment with lacing at some point. So you cut like the straps like in the back, the slits in the back and like mess with that. I don't know. It looks really complicated to me. So we're going to have to see how that one goes. Um, but yeah, please comment, subscribe, all sorts of fun stuff. Catch you on the flip side.